everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Lucia here. This little throwback number on the radio. Gotta appreciate it. Um, it's sprinkling here in San Diego and I just seen a rainbow and call me childish, but I got so excited just seeing that as soon as I got in my car. Like it's just so beautiful. Nature's gift to us. So I just wanted to say good morning. It's gonna be a lovely day. Yes, I'm leaving a little bit late for my house. I'm not on the freeway yet. But um, I was just putting like dinner to cook, AKA the slow cooker, AKA the crock pot. Because man, the crock pot saves lives, let me tell you. Because sometimes when I, um, you know, get out of work, I really don't wanna just cook. And my boyfriend gets, he's tired too. Like we don't wanna do shit, so. I mean, I've been doing like easy things these past couple of days, so. Like, what did I do on Monday? Oh, Monday I did hot wings. Those are easy. Then, Tuesday, he wanted meatball subs. So I made meatball subs. And then Wednesday was yesterday. I made spaghetti. That's easy also with meatballs. And then, today's Thursday. So, Thursday is going to be Mississippi roast. And if you haven't made a Mississippi roast... <laughs> girl guys what are you fucking doing like it's like the easiest thing to make seriously like you get a chuck roast right you sear it on both sides so pan with a little bit of oil i do like high heat and then i sear both sides and then once i've seared both sides um sorry hold on let me get on my correct lane here um, once I sear both sides, um, then you just throw it in the crock pot and then you get a packet of ranch, like the powder ranch, like, you know, wh wherever you mix or dip or whatever, make dip or whatever ranch dip. So you get one packet of ranch dip and you just sprinkle it on the meat that's in the crock pot after you've seared it. Then you grab a packet of french onion soup like the lipton or if you don't want to buy the lipton i got it because it was on sale it was like 1.99 for like three packets so, and then you just sprinkle the the same just like you did the ranch but over the um the roast again so you have the ranch down you put the onion whatever you as long as you have all the ingredients it doesn't matter what order okay so then once you do that um you're gonna take a stick of butter yes it's not healthy but I mean you don't eat this every day and you're sharing it so enjoy it a whole stick of butter in then you put the recipe calls for eight pepperoncinis but put as many as you want I put I put eight or however many was left in my jar because I had a big ass one and I've been making it over the past months so just put the pepperoncinis on top and since I only had seven and a half because it looked like one had popped at the bottom of the jar i just splashed some um pepper juice pepper chini juice god that's so hard to say um you can add a little bit of water too if you want more jus but like dude just let that shit on low go to work come back your house smells like fucking bomb as hell <coughs> man smells like pepper chini juice funky but I washed my hands. I don't know. That vinegar, yo. That vinegar don't play. But, I'm out. <laughs> but, well, I guess my boyfriend was like, oh, today's my, my um, half a day. He works half a day. And it's raining or sprinkling, whatever. So, so he works half a day. So, um, what should I call it? So, I mean, if he goes, he goes in at 8, so he'll probably get off 12-ish. Unless his boss wants him to stay longer, which sometimes happens. But, I mean, even if he's there by 3, I think he has to cook for, like, 6 to 8 hours. Slowly, on low. And when you get home, your house smells amazing. You're going to love it. It pulls apart, like, freaking, like, easy. It's so delicious, so tender, so juicy. And then it's up to you. Like, you can serve it. Um, I get the little artisan buns from Vons, the soft look. They look like dinner rolls. Yeah, they're dinner rolls. That's what they are. 
Um, but I have done it with like sourdough bread or sliced French bread. And it's really good. Like it's freaking bomb. Like the flavors, I don't know how. I mean, maybe it's a stick of butter, maybe it's the seasonings, but it's so good. And it's just like I I fed like a bunch of people on that shit. Like, and I know it's Thursday night, so I'm expecting, I'm thinking there's gonna be people at my house because they're always just on Thursday night to watch football. I don't know why these guys don't want to go watch it at home with their wives, but um, I guess they just want to hang out over here. Over here at my place because my place is like a freaking tiny little ant farm and they have these big ass houses, but whatever. Um, but I know every time like if his friends are over, my boyfriend's friends are over or, you know, their friends are over. I think last time his dad was over and he loved it. He's like, wow, you really know, you really like to cook, huh? And I'm like, it's easy. Like, I can give you the recipe. Like, it's, I mean, look how easy. I mean, I told you like right now and you can literally just go get it. The stuff. And it's, it's just so juicy. It's so flavorful. It's perfect for that comfort food. Like, especially now that it's, you know, it's, a, I mean, yeah, it's like the holiday season has started. I mean, it's October, so um, definitely, definitely, it's just going to be an easy thing to do. So, I mean, just do it. Just do it and comment when you do because it's so fucking bomb. You will not regret it. Um, I've made, it's just a beef chuck roast. I mean, if you don't like beef or you don't eat it, I get it. You know, not everybody likes to eat dead cows and shit. But, I mean, I'm pretty sure you could do it with a different type of protein and it's come out good. I mean, I don't know. Like, the last time I slow cooked some chicken, I didn't do the same recipe. I just did, like garlic salt and pepper and paprika um and i chopped up some onions i mean it's like endless like you do what you want to do and your flavors and my chicken was juicy as fuck my brother even came over and had some later and i made like a pot of rice um oh i could probably make rice later it depends i don't i just like to eat it with the bread i think that's enough carbs but i made like this garlic butter rice successfully because I don't I'm not that good at it probably because I don't have a chop for my my pot but um yeah like um I don't know it's just like so good but I mean I'm sure there's so many recipes you can do in the crock pot like you just set it and forget it and then come back home and I remember the first time I made this roast it was at my old apartment and you know I have two little dogs I have Penny and Belle chihuahua and a min pin and i worked like literally one or two exits away from home now i'm like 30 exits away i guess but whatever and i had made it and i've never like slow cooked anything while i was at work and no one was at home so i was like so concerned i mean i did it but like i was like Is my apartment gonna set on fire are my babies gonna be okay like I was so paranoid like at lunch I went home just to check but let me tell you the house was fine my doggies were fine they're probably a little bit tortured because of the delicious aroma but it was super good it was like oh my god and I was like just with like two forks I just like spread that spread that bread spread that beef around and just let it soak in the juices and then I, I think I left I don't know if I left it on warm or on low but holy moly it was so good like stupid good so I mean it's an easy thing to do guys like if you want to try it out like by all means um you know my boyfriend doesn't eat the whole pot by the time I get home I'll do like a little mini clip of it because it's super good Where is it my so I washed my hair. I know I shouldn't be washing my hair all the time, but I did. I've been doing it. I washed it like three days in a row, but I did put that tea tree. The tea tree um dry shampoo. I like the way it smells and I like it. I just like it. So this motherfucker better not 
think like he's gonna fucking cut me off. I'm not gonna let you, bitch. People are just so disrespectful. Like, I hate that shit. Like, you see me driving here, and you're just like, like, you know, you just know they're trying to cut you off. You feel me? Like, like you're getting really close to my fucking car. Then you act like you're gonna merge, but I don't see no blinker. If I see a blinker, hey bitch, go in. Like, let me get out of your way. Let me slow down and give you access. You know what I mean? Like, you don't have to be an asshole pretty much on the road. You don't. Like, it's optional. Asshole is optional on the road. So, but my eye keeps leaking. I'm feeling a lot better. I think my voice sounds a little better. I don't know if I remembered to bring my inhaler because I found it. I guess it got stuck in my... having a lovely day um I, and honestly like i'm so ready i feel like i'm ready like it was so funny yesterday um there i go again i just keep going don't i um i went to ulta with my friend yesterday my friend roxy and um it was so funny because like i walked in and one of the girls like oh my god i love your face and i love your hair and I was just like, oh, things. And I'm like, I'm all thinking to myself, like, yeah, my hair's fading. Because, I mean, I've been washing it. But I've been washing it on purpose. Because, I don't know, I just definitely, I feel like I just want to, like, just go to my natural color already. I don't know. People, like, confuse me. The California Conservation Corps. Okay, CCC. But I'm just like... Starbucks downstairs, but well, Pete's coffee machine downstairs, <coughs> and they have um, Pete's. I mean, in Starbucks, I don't want to spend on that. I mean, I could because I brought lunch. So, speaking of lunch, I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna have my my, shake. my chocolate shake. day a lovely rainy day if you're here in Southern California San Diego um, I don't see the rainbow I think the rain's back there up here it's looking pretty clear like a little bit gray but a little bit clear and blue like in some like patchy like scattered showers I guess but um, yeah I hope everyone's having a lovely day and I will see you guys